Yo, what's up guys? This is kind of a spontaneous video idea. Right now it is Friday night. I was at work all day. I come home to a package that had arrived from America. Gonna unbox it right now. If you guys can guess what it is, drop a comment in the comment section below and let me know what you think this package is gonna be. So I was tired from work, so I took a quick nap. Now I'm awake, trying to be awake for this video right now. Shouts out to all the new subscribers, what's up? Thanks for subbing to my channel. Um, if you're new here, go check out the rest of my videos. I make some videos on skateboarding and stuff. The last video was pretty sick in my opinion. I liked editing that a lot, that was cool. But yeah, I'm gonna unbox this box right here. I've never really done an unboxing like this on my channel. Um, I'm pretty excited. I felt like opening it right then and there, like once I come through the door and seen it was a package, I just wanted to rip it open, but I was like, I wanna save my genuine reaction for you guys, so you guys are gonna see my absolute genuine reaction to opening this box right now from the States. So yeah, I don't know really what else to say. I got some new shoes. We had our work Christmas party like last year, obviously because it's 2020 now, 2020 game. Um, and we all got gifts from the shop and the shop gave me a pair of Converse, but I didn't like them. So I got the receipt and I took them back to the Converse outlet and I swapped them out just for some normal um, high top Chuck Taylors. You guys can see, these aren't the skate ones though, but I think I'm just gonna like put some like super glue and stuff here to make it like last a bit longer, but yeah. I hope this angle works, I had to put a light here, but yeah. I don't have a box cutter, I got a pair of scissors. Um, sorry if this video is super low brow and low quality. I'm just really keen to open this package right now, so get that chair out of the shot. I don't know, I'm really OCD when it comes to filming stuff and it, I kind of overthink everything and make a big deal out of nothing, so. Here we go guys, um, yeah, I'm gonna open this box, Ugh, it's pretty heavy, am I in the middle of the frame? I hope so. Alright guys, here's this box that arrived from America today, it's Friday night, I'm at home by myself, I'm about to open this damn box, this is a YouTube unboxing video. Here we go. I did have a box cutter, I don't know where it is. So um, I'm gonna use these orange pair of scissors right here. Probably doing this the hardest way in the world. There we go. I feel like a kid on Christmas morning. Oh. All right, clearly I had decks made and um, shipped to Australia. So yeah, these are the boards right here. I haven't seen the gravity in real life yet. So I'll give you guys a better. Oh, these are heavy. I got 10 decks made up like I don't know, a month ago or whatever. And I just had to wait till I had the money to ship them to Australia. So here they are right now. So yeah, here are the boards right here. You can kind of see the, god damn. Can you guys see this graphic? It's Jesus. The camera doesn't really do it justice. There's a fly sitting on the side of the lens right here. Um, yeah, my friend Zach, my good friend Zach, shouts out Zach. He went to, uh, where did he go? I think he went to Argentina and he took his camera obviously because he's a photographer. He took this photo of Jesus. I think it was in like a cemetery somewhere, but he sent me over a bunch of images to play with. So I come up with this graphic right here. I'm gonna give you guys a better look at the graphic. I'm just like, Showing you the you guys the board right now, so yeah. Ugh. Feel like I need to take some photos. One second. Gotta keep that Instagram story popping, you know. Ugh. But yeah. Who's who's excited? 
Who's excited for uh, these evening decks? I'm, I'm pretty excited. If you can't tell by my monotone voice and my lack of enthusiasm. Um, <laughs> for the record guys, um, I don't know, I've been skateboarding a long time. Like I've been skating since I was like four years old. I know I should be a pro by now, but like, I don't know, skating isn't as popular in Australia. And it's really easy to become unmotivated to skate and not interested in skating anymore because I don't know, there's not much I've seen. Anyway, what I'm trying to say is like, it's awesome to be able to like do this, like pretty much, I took, a, I took the photo that Zach gave me and I threw a design together and a logo for my brand and I put them on decks and I got them printed. Like it's sick that you can do this in 2020 because we're in 2020 now. It's awesome that we're able to do this. Um, I never thought I'd be able to like, I know it sounds stupid because I'm like, oh, I never thought that I'd be able to make boards. Like anyone can make boards. That's cool. But like, it feels like, it feels like I'm doing something with my life, if that makes sense. Because like I'm putting my time and energy into something that I have an interest and a passion for, which is skateboarding and like just skateboarding lifestyle and all that stuff. I don't know if I'm babbling on. I feel like I babble on and I don't make sense to anybody. But yeah, really excited to have these boards. Um, I don't know. Yeah, it's sick, it's dope. I'm gonna keep getting these boards out right now. <laughs> oh God. Shouts out to UPS for uh, delivering this, the United States Postal Service. My other camera died, so I'm back on the G7X. I'm gonna pop one of these open just to give you guys a better look. And just so I can get a better look at these boards too. Cause yeah, if I'm selling something with my name to it, I wanna make sure it's proper quality. Cause I don't wanna sell something and then it'd be crap because that'd suck and then I'd get a bad name. And then I'd be awake at night trying to sleep, but I can't sleep because I'm thinking about something that happened during the day. <laughs> Oh my god. Alright. As you guys can see, we got we got evening mob decks on deck, man. 2020 evening deck. Evening mob gang. 2020 evening mob gang. Um yeah, what sizes did I get? I got some 8.5s, I got a couple 8.5s, three 8.5s, an 838, another uh, 825, another 825, an 8. A25, 8, and an 838. So all up I got 10 boards. Check it out guys, that's all of them there. I only got 10 because um, these boards come from the Northern Hemisphere. So they got, I think they got pressed out in Mexico to be honest. Um, I think these boards are made in Mexico, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, I got these 10 decks made. Um, obviously, I had to pay in US currency, so if you're an Australian, you know that our dollar sucks compared to the US, so um, yeah, I'm going to put these up for sale soon. I just need to kind of quality control check everything to make sure that they're all good, make sure all the deck holes are like aligned and stuff, and yeah, I mean, these are this steep concave. What do you guys think? Do you guys think this is steep enough? I don't know. The shape, the 8.5 shape doesn't seem too bad, to be honest. I mean, I just don't know how these boards skate yet, so I might have to like trial one for myself just to see how they are before I sell them to anyone or if anyone's keen. But I know a couple of people are keen just to have them as wall boards. I mean, yeah. I might end up keeping one just as a wall board, who knows. All right, that's better. You can see me, I'm in the frame now. Uh, shouts out to the lower 48 states, Hawaii and Alaska, you aren't really America. I know he's in America, but he's not really America. <laughs> I'm only kidding. Uh, shouts out if I have any people watching the video from Alaska or Hawaii. Good. Smells good. I would have, if they made car air fresheners that smell like new decks, I would have one in my car. 
So these, this is 8.5, um, the steep concave. But yeah, that's, it looks better. The graphic looks better without the plastic on, obviously, because it's shiny, but you guys can have a better look now. Um, as I said, Zach actually took this photo. I'll probably chuck in a photo of what the photo was before I edited it in the video. And then I just went to town and just photoshopped some other stuff in, as well as the evening logo to go on top. But yeah, I mean, it looks sick. The camera doesn't really do it justice. You can't really, I mean, the image is quite dark here. So you can't really see that well what's going on unless it's just my camera. But yeah, I mean, it's sick. I like it. I like the graphic a lot. Damn, I don't know what else to say, guys. Shout out to all the new subscribers to my channel. It's good to have you here. It's good to uh, see you guys here. But yeah, I have 10 of these. I'll probably keep one for myself to skate or one to keep on the wall. I don't know. The rest I'll have up for sale soon enough. Just stay tuned, guys. So that pretty much wraps it up for the um, unboxing video. I mean, there's not much else I can really do. Shouts out to everybody that's bought something from Evening Mob so far. It means a lot. If you want to purchase one of these decks, you can hit me up on Instagram. Or I'll probably have them up on the Evening Mob website pretty soon. You just got to stay tuned. Like I said, I just wanted to go for a few quality control checks on these boards. So I know they're like ridden and tested and abused by me before anyone else buys them. Because I don't want to feel bad if they like, they're not, they don't live up to the standard. <sighs> Does that make sense what I'm trying to say? God damn. My throat hurts guys. Anyway, thanks for watching the video. If you guys are new here, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Leave a thumbs up. Drop a comment below if you enjoyed this video, this little unboxing. I know people watch unboxing videos online. I've watched a few, I don't know. I watch a lot of weird content on YouTube these days. It's pretty funny. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to let you guys go. I'm going to muck around on these boards a bit more. Um, yeah, thanks for watching the video, guys. Shouts out to all the new subscribers. Um, comment down below where you're from. I just want to, I know it's like the majority of my audience is from the States because I've looked at my analytics and it's all like from America. Um, there's a little bit of a percentage from Australia. It depends on what video really. But yeah, I'm going to stop babbling on. Thank you again for watching the video. Hope to see all you guys' faces in the next one. So yeah, cheers. Take care. Catch you all later.